What's up guys? I'm in my shop in Phoenix, Arizona. And today starts Mike Myers workshop. It's Thursday, July 6th, and I'm pretty excited. I get to meet Mike Myers. I've always wanted to meet him. I've been talking with him for years online when I started pinstriping and um, well actually when I started sign painting because I started pinstriping first. My mentor Eddie Torres, you know, got me on that route. And then eventually he told me, you know what? You should stick to sign painting because nobody's doing it out here. And there's a lot of competition in pinstriping. I think you would do really good in sign painting. So 2009, I started my journey as a sign painter and there wasn't very much you know, content out there for me to look for to teach myself. And I wasn't making any money to sign up for classes. So what did I do? I started meeting other sign painters, messaging them, you know, I, I would find them on Facebook. I would literally send them messages, asking them questions and Mike Myers was one of them. So it's an honor to get to meet him finally in person and put on this class hosted by me it's the west coast tour so i'm pretty excited i know most people really don't give a shit about lettering and sign painting and stuff but um i've been obsessed with lettering my whole life that's for a different show a different story i'm going to talk about that eventually but for sure today is the day mike myers is going to be in the building teaching this workshop in my studio so it's an exciting day so please join me today for what is the beginning of this mike meyer west coast tour and let's have some fun class is about to start starts at 10 a.m at the grand r house Mike Myers is here. Get ready.
calm before the storm. Stopped and got me a little coffee, of course. And we're in the shop. Mike should be on his way. Class starts at 10. But I'm going to show you some of like what we started yesterday. Hold on. Put my coffee down so I can do this. But so this was one of the students, actually, a couple of the students that were over here working here this is some of the some of the stuff we were looking at but today we're doing script lettering so he's got this stuff out oh let's see we're also doing casual so he's going to be teaching us how to do some casual lettering and stuff yesterday we did block and of course, like I said, today is gonna be script. These are some old samples he was he's got for us. He was uh, teaching us block style and doing numbers. <coughs> <coughs> but also, <clears throat> super cool is uh, <clears throat> he was making me these these things right here. Is that light? Are the lights on? No. Um. He was making me these things right here, practicing in class. He he wrote my name and he made this number chart. So I'm gonna hang that up in my shop and use it as reference. But yeah, here's the easels. I already put my my papers away because I'm saving everything that I do here. But oh, I dropped this. Oh, those ants on there. That's weird. All right. But yeah, this is something. He was teaching us yesterday. We were doing the the bars, you know, doing them with the with the with the yardstick and a pencil, and then going in and filling in the letters. But yeah, basically, it was pretty fun. And then Fadado, he's another student that was in here. He was back here doing this but we were just stacking the papers as we were painting but check this out so this is this was the poster he made for the for the shop for the workshop guess who that is <laughs> but yeah he hand lettered it on and took a picture of it and made it into the poster for the shop but yeah he also brought a bunch of books and was showing us a little bit of uh you know basically what books inspire are good for inspiration um this is one of my favorites this is one of my favorite sign painters this is noel weber if you ever seen this book you better pick it up look at that it's all his sketches and mock-ups for different signs that he's painted but it's nothing but beautiful lettering if you follow my channel you probably love lettering at least almost as much as I do if you get a chance to get rock and jelly beans book definitely pick it up look at this if you're into poster art skateboard art his style is just it's kind of like a Jim Phillips meets Robert Williams and uh, you know, just old school rat rod culture art, you know. Day two here at the Spock shop, the Grand Art House. Let's go. I'm so excited. Can you tell? Can you tell I'm super excited? Because uh, this is dope. I'm loving it. I'm loving it. Oh yeah, by the way, this, this mural here was painted by uh, <clears throat> one of my good friends out of Chicago. She goes by Kind. The artist Kind. Megan Kind. Oh snap! Who's that? Uh oh. <laughs> oh, I thought you were about to twerk. <laughs> Are these good to eat? Yeah. 
They're delicious. <laughs> get a little bit to come out of there. Get a little bit of that cactus milk. He did it again, guys. He did it again. Hey, My dyslexic done. homie wrote First Fridays. <laughs> oh, wait. No, he didn't. He wrote First Fridas. Okay. Well, he's doing the instructions. We're looking for these guys. He's doing another thing. Cheap behind. What's up guys? So that was the end of the workshop. We're still here with Mr. Mike Myers. Hey! I'm still excited. Thanks, Spock. We rocked it. Yeah. See you guys later. Of course. Yeah. Oh, Dino. We got Dino There's here. Dino. Yep. Hey but the class was amazing. Thank yeah. you so much. And um Hope you guys too. Yeah, <laughs> Team Cannon. Yeah. <laughs> Team Cannon. No Nikons around here, baby. <laughs> just icons. Yeah, just oh snap, oh snap. Class was great. We enjoyed it. Hope you guys enjoyed it too. And maybe we'll do it again. He's, he's coming back for the winter. And let's Go see what happens. Out. And thank you, and thank you, and thank you again. <laughs> and see you later. Bow. You made the box. All right, there it is. Right there with world's fastest Indian. Yeah. World's fastest Indian. There Indian. it is. Literally. <laughs> nice. I'm working for me. I don't know. I'm working for free. I'm working for me. Yep. Hell yeah. Later on, guys. Oh, yeah. That's just. There goes Mike Myers. Later! <laughs> West Coast Tour. They're off to... See the wizard. See the wizard in Flagstaff. And then off to Colorado Springs. Springs for the next stop in the West Coast Tour for Mike Myers. Sign workshop. workshop. It was dope. It was so cool. I had so much fun. And I can't wait to do it again. I wish you didn't have to leave. Such a fun person to hang out with. It's a trip because it feels like you've known him for a long time. Yeah, he's just cool like that, huh? Yeah. Yep. What's well, the general consensus of like? A lot this of guys us are always the same using way. big words. What? A lot of us are the same way. Yeah. Yep. I mean, seriously. Me, Artie. Mm -hmm. me, you know, Marshall. Yep. Like, if we all hung out together, it'd be like, dude, we're all the same. Like, yeah. we all think the same. We all just like the same things. It's, it's cool. We're all into the same stuff. It's like we're fans of the same team. Yeah. Of pinstriping, lettering, airbrushing, things of that sort. Custom culture in general. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, it's 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 cool. It's, it's really definitely cool. cool. I love it, and we learned a little bit, 
I learned a lot. It's going to make us better at what we do. I learned how much more I suck. <laughs> <laughs> He's not lying, guys. He's not lying. You should have seen I it. I learned how bad dyslexia can Oh, my God. <laughs> Did you guys see that video? It's going to be in this video. So, yes. First Fritas. <laughs> yeah. Welcome to First Fritas, guys. Hey, that, that's that's going to be a thing. Watch. Yeah. I should have just made that. All right. That's the end of this video. It was three days of just total awesomeness. I hope you guys liked it as much as we did. Oh. <laughs> My arms are getting tired. My There's arms earthquakes in Arizona. Hey, it's earthquake season <laughs> around here. But yeah, hope you guys liked the video. I'll have the full interview and the full podcast session on my website soon. It's it's long. Maybe I'll yeah. create a Patreon for Is this. It two hours? It was two hours and like 12 minutes. It doesn't seem like it though because if you're... Um, and into bit, it. Yeah, if you're an avid sign painter, pinstriper, or just custom culture guy, whatever, and you want to know some history, especially about sign painting, that's not really something that people cover the most. You just hear it when you're actually at meets. Mm -hmm. You know, so when you talk, you want to hear like a true sign painter, and you hear like some of their background and what they know about the history, this is the podcast for you. Yep. Yeah. So maybe I'll create a Patreon because I hear you could put full videos on there and all that. This is definitely. I don't know how long Spotify of videos. Way, yeah, it's a video interview though. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I mean, I could get they the audio. I could put the audio on Spotify. Oh, do they? Yep. Okay. Well, either way, thank you guys, and we'll see you in the next adventure. Later. Peace.